Okay guys, what we're going to do in this video is to show you how you can add a custom font to Power BI. Following a good tip from a friend of mine, Rob in FIFA, he said that for my report that I'm looking at here, to pop a little bit more, we could add the FIFA World Cup font. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna show you how to add a custom font with the FIFA World Cup font as an example. So let's delve straight into Power BI. Okay, so in the Power BI, I've just opened a completely new workbook. And what we will go through is the themes section. So in Power BI, you can create your own sort of template or theme that you would like to use. And the way we need to go about this is to customize current theme. Normally this will be grayed out, but because I did a slight modification, it is showing okay, but I will go through the way you will have to look at it. So what you will do, we'll just come on the first color, you take a random one, adjust it slightly, so it is a little bit different. Select apply, and then come back here. So in the themes, you should now be able to save the current theme. We find where we want to have a look at it. We select this one and we select new. That's what I want to call it. Select save. And now we have a new theme. What we will need to do then is to go into that folder. So let's all just find that folder where we saved this theme. There we go. This is where I have saved my theme. So you can see it here. We can open this one and you can see the following text. What we need to do, I will drop this information in the comments section. So you can just copy paste that. So let's just copy paste this one into the new one. And here is where you add the, col the font name. So let's say you wanted to include Montserrat. You can just type in Montserrat and do the same again in this one. So two places you need to change the format, the text, and other than that, you're good to go. We can now just select save, just exit this one, and just take down this one, and we can come back to Power BI. So now in Power BI, what we can do is come back to themes, and now we can look for a specific theme. We come in here, and we can see we have the World Cup new and the old World Cup. So this is the one we just created. We can open this one. And then the file has successfully been added. Okay. Normally what I do, I close the software and open it again because sometimes it don't picks up the font because you need to go to a different location on your laptop to find that font and tell Power BI how that should look. But let's have a look. If we try to insert a text box and we try to type in Sport Horizon and you can see that straight away that that is definitely the World Cup font that we were looking at. So that is working perfectly fine and that's how you can add a custom font. If you have any problems or if you have any questions, please let us know in the comment sections below at info at sporthorizon.co.uk or message Kieran Dilley or Johannes Martinusen on LinkedIn. Thank you guys.